Hey guys, it's Super Kami Guru 9000. I'm Christian and that is Corey and we are here to review One Piece chapter 670. Awesome chapter. Let's get into it. So three of the Straw Hat Pirates are in front of Caesar's Palace. We got Robin, Frankie, and Luffy. And we got a strong writer from, not Luffy, Frankie. And he's just tearing it up. It's awesome to see him do some of his standard famous moves of the Frankster. And uh, Luffy, Tashigi, and Smoker end up fighting for a minute in the beginning of the chapter. And uh, Smoker gets pwned by Luffy, but it's actually Tashigi. And uh, Luffy's like, why are you so weak now, man? And he's just like, has his smoke horn behind his back, which is also really cool. Because now that Luffy is a hockey user, we're seeing him able to take on Logia types, which brings Luffy to a whole new level in this series. Because we all know how invincible Logia types seem to have been through that first half. But now I think in the second half, it's all equal. And uh, Tashigi uh, pokes Luffy a few times with the sea stone rod. And he's like, ow, ow. And, and then he's like, hey, wait a second. He goes, your second, grabs him. He's like, look, man, we're going to fight later after you're back in your body. And you're strong and at full power, because I want an epic battle. None of this pussy crap. In the last chapter, we retreated to this little hint that there might be this huge, like, poisonous blob monster that's going to start attacking everybody. And it does start attacking everybody this week in a really cool manner. It actually comes down in chunks from the sky, just landing all over the place and destroying everything. And these blobs are amorphous, and they're moving all over the place, and they're killing all of these uh, marines and pirates and everything. And, you know, they're poisonous to the touch, so you can't touch them. And the only thing you really need to do is push them in water. And since you can't touch them, you're pretty much screwed. So they try the next best thing. Kill it with they fire. Kill it with fire. And they do try some fire. And you know what? These things are extremely flammable. They're actually explosive. And you can actually see the pirate ship just, boom, just explodes into this ridiculously huge explosion. And even the straw hats are freaked out. Everybody's just like... You know, the black and white thing. This is really awesome looking. You know, all light has been driven away by this awesome explosion. And uh, this doesn't seem to be stopping this blob, even though it's just been sort of exploded all over the place. It's actually using itself to throw itself onto land and everything, which I think is actually really cool. And uh, while it's attacking everybody, uh, Caesar Clown actually does make his way into the battlefield. And uh, he starts to go into his villain monologuing speech. And, uh, you know, he talks about the land of fire and the land of ice and how when all of these blobs come together, they will destroy you all. And uh, then he starts to monologue about something that happened previously four years ago. And before he can even finish speaking, Luffy just immediately jumps up and grabs his ass and he's like, gotcha, bitch! So what did Super Comic Guru 9000 think of One Piece 670? Honestly, I thought it started out strong. We're actually getting some progression with the Caesar thing. They're not taking their time, you know, with it, like making a big plan or anything. This isn't Naruto. We're just getting right to it. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, Luffy already caught Caesar, supposedly. Oh, my gosh. You know, obviously Caesar's not going to go down that easy, I think. But, uh, and also the uh, Tashigi Smoker thing. They, uh, I don't know, Smoker and Luffy have this weird sort of love-hate relationship where Smoker is, like, tied to his job to chase Luffy and uh, at the same time, Luffy sort of respects him, and but at the same time doesn't take him seriously. So it was some cool development there with him stuck in Tashigi's body. Um, I agree. This was a fun chapter. Um, yes. And maybe not an action-packed one, but there was a lot of things that made me laugh. Uh, the art was hilarious this week. Uh, one thing that you just said that I actually thought was really good, I like the, uh, the dynamic uh, between Smoker and Luffy. Mm -hmm. And how, you know, they're, they're enemies, but at the same time, they kind of have fun with each other. And uh, I, I think that's uh, very similar to this other series called Lupin the Third between the character Lupin and the detective Zenigata, which there is a Lupin the anime going on right now, which you guys should check out. It's pretty awesome. But uh, still, just really fun chapter. All the blobs, those things are freaking freaky, man. You yeah. know, they'll, they'll poison you to the touch, but then when you find out that they just explode, <laughs> which is just ridiculous. And, and, you know, just a little bit of fire creates this hilariously big explosion, which I think is awesome. Um, I love that Frankie is involved right here. I think he's a great uh, straw hat pirate that I think is not utilized enough. A lot of people he's, say a, he's, he's a big giant cyborg. We need to make him do more. He's one and of all favorites. he did was bust in a, a door off screen this week. And, you know, I know more stuff is going to happen later. So uh, hopefully we'll get to see him do more. And uh, Caesar Clown at the end, uh, I think that's really funny that Luffy's not letting him monologue whatsoever. <laughs> he's like, fuck you, bitch. No flashback for you. No flashbacks. <laughs> you know, he's not going to let him get into that. But, uh, you know, I don't think Caesar Clown is going to go down that easily. You know, I think he's a, a pretty cool new character. And, uh, you know, it's just cool to see that Luffy can now grab Logia characters, you know, physically. Uh, so that means, uh, you know, we can't wait to see him fight Akainu. Oh, yeah. That's going to bring it to the oh, next yeah. level. But who's to say Akainu didn't get stronger? Mm -hmm. So, you know, we're not sure if Luffy is on that level yet. Or, you know, who knows where some of the higher echelon characters are. So Luffy still has a lot of improving to do. But it's cool to see him grab Logia types. Because I think that, like I said, it brings the series to a next level. It brings the Straw Hats up to, you know, an ability to compete on the higher levels mm -hmm. in One Piece. So for a rating this week, we're going to drop a 7 out of 10 on this One Piece, only because we know it can get bigger and better, and it 
obviously it's going to. We got Caesar on the battlefield. We got, you know, Luffy taking on one of the coolest new Logia types we've seen in this series. And uh, I only look forward to the next few One Piece chapters. You guys know we love anime, but we also love video games, which is exactly why Corey and I did E3 coverage this year. So check out these three videos up top and uh, click the annotated link and check them out. They're, you know, they were a lot of fun to make. It's cool to talk about something different. And also, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give us a big thumbs up. It's always appreciated. And until next time, Super Comic Guru 9000, out.